Hi everyone, it's Akila. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And I'm gonna need everyone to stop what they're doing because Bloxburg has finally updated since Valentine's Day. Yes, you heard that correctly. Valentine's Day. That is so crazy. I know the community was getting kind of impatient. I was getting impatient myself, but I really hope that this update was worth the wait. This is like our first big update with the new development team. So I'm really excited to see what they brought to the table. So with that being said, let's go ahead and read the update log. So it says version 0.11.5, added fancy industrial pipe furniture sets, industrial pipe furniture sets that sounds really interesting added various beauty products yes queens added miscellaneous furniture and decorative items added bed canopies and comforters added newspaper and magazine interaction oh my gosh i hope we can pick up the newspaper because i've really been wanting to take a poop with the newspaper in my hand duh like doesn't that make sense for role plays Maybe not so much for me, but my roleplay husband for sure. General animation improvements. We'll get into that because that's what I'm really here for. Of course, removed Valentine's items and decorations. Now we can go ahead and put our Valentine's Day items in our inventories because I kind of forgot about that. As always, major bug fixes. Okay, now let's just talk about this really quickly because we finally have our walks back if you have an animation pack you should have it back the walk that we had was not cutting it it was so crusty so dusty but i'm glad i have my bubbly walk back because it's definitely much cuter okay everyone so i'm finally out of build mode and that actually took a while because for the first time in a long time, I felt overwhelmed in the decorate category because we just got so many new things. But I'm mainly excited to see which things are animated. But before we start clicking on things, let's do a quick overview of everything that we got. First of all, we got some hairspray, which is so exciting. Then we have this Easy Beauty Skin Moisturizer. Looks like we have some scent deodorant and hair gel as well. And then right here we have one of those sleeping masks and hopefully we can interact with that. I'd be surprised if we couldn't. Behind these items, there's this like toiletry bag, which is so cute and jewelry holders. I never thought I'd see the day. I really love this heart necklace because it looks like the one that my avatar always wears. So that's pretty cool. And then we have three different types of face masks. So this one is strawberry, that one is cucumber, and I believe this one is banana. And then these are all of the new makeup items that we got. And these two actually came in like a bunch of different color swatches, but I only put down two of them. So now we have separate makeup items and we don't have just like that one makeup set that we've had for the longest amount of time and there's just so many things that we can put on all of our surfaces in our Bloxburg houses now. There's also like a little illuminated compact mirror. We have some more makeup brushes and we have some updated nail polish sets. We also got some really cool nail filers. And behind that, these are two different sets. So we have this set of like luxury perfumes and then we have this one. I'm not sure what it's called. Now we got these two items last update, I believe, but now we can like interact with them. So we'll check that out for sure. There's also three pairs of glasses now. So we have these like reading glasses and two pairs of sunglasses. There's also a watch now. Two different types of combs. So we have this pick and then we have a wide tooth comb. We have this decorative set of keys. Can't do anything with the slippers. I'm not surprised about that, but it would be pretty cool. Okay, I'm so excited for this. We have the sleeping mask, so we're gonna put that on. We can take it, okay? We can walk around with it, pretty cool. But what does the animation look like? So we click use and then we put it on and that animation was so smooth, it was so quick and we can actually stop the animation and we just go back to holding it. 
Wait, that is so freaking cool. And it fits perfectly. I thought it was kind of going to fit janky. It probably depends on the face that you have, but it definitely works for super happy face. So, oh my goodness, let's put that down and let's see what else we can use. So there's the moisturizer. So again, we can pick that up. Let's do a get ready with me. So I have my skin moisturizer and we're gonna use that. Okay, so we take the top off and we're applying the moisturizer to our face. And then we put the top back on. We've never gotten animations like this in Bloxburg, obviously, because we have new people on the development team, but they are eating this up. This is just so amazing. Like this is a game changer, especially for people who do role plays and want to be more realistic. This is amazing. Okay, let's check out the hairspray. So we have the hairspray and we're taking the top off again and we shook it up. Look, we're shaking it up and we're spraying the hairspray. Pigtails are gonna be staying all day long. Are you kidding me? I absolutely love this. Wow, I am truly amazed. Like the talent. Okay, time for the deodorant. So again, we're gonna take the top off and apply the deodorant just like that. The way the arms are like bending and it's just, it's just so good. I'm not gonna lie though, these like, these items are pretty big. They take up a lot of counter space, which is fine. Like you're gonna have to be picky and choosy if you have a small restroom on what you wanna put down. But we have this toiletry bag. Oh man, I thought we could carry this around. That's okay. So these are just for decoration, of course. And we have the hair glue. So we can do something with that. Okay, another really cool, smooth animation. Something simple, that one was, it was cute, it was cute. Most of these makeup items, we can actually like take with us. So we have this one, and we have a little brush, and we're like applying it in like a circular motion, which is, again, really accurate. Yeah, it's pretty much gonna be the same animation for most of these little powders, I'm guessing. I mean, yeah, I really wouldn't expect a different animation for like every single one. So yeah, you guys get, wait, oh, the glitter ones actually add glitter to your face. Wait a minute, hold the phone. That is so cute. I guess we're just gonna move on with sparkles on our face. Wait, we do have the face mask though. So what if I take this strawberry face mask and put that on. Maybe we'll have a face mask up here too. It actually did and we still have the sparkles on our face, I believe, but look, we have like two little strawberries on our eyes. So relaxing, so refreshing. Maybe eventually it'll just fade away, but I guess we'll find out later. Let's try to apply this mask on too. This is the cucumber mask. Okay, a classic. You cannot go wrong with this one. And then the banana mask, which is also really fun because I feel like I've only seen this in Korean skincare. And I had something similar to this and I love the way it smelled. Okay, which mask is your favorite? But I'm kind of rocking with the classic, you know, cucumber one. I guess we'll find out and see how long this mask lasts. Maybe if we take a shower, the mask and the makeup will come off. Okay, so I'm on my role play plot now and I just applied the mask because if you loaded a new plot, your mask is gonna come off and we are gonna click the sink and we can actually wash our face. Look, we're scrubbing our face. And now the mask is gone. That is so cool. I'm literally obsessed and it happens after one time. Like the first time you do it, it's gone. So you don't have to stay there for that long. But look, I also realized that there's a new mesh for the brush. So this is what the brush looks like now. If you guys remember what it looked like before, it was literally just like, I mean like it just was not detailed. It was basically like flat. So 
Now we have some texture on this brush. Looks like this animation changed too. Um, now I'm just interested. Is is there a new animation for this? This looks new too, but I don't think I used the blow dryer enough to know. What about, okay, we can't interact with this. What about the toothpaste? We still cannot interact with the toothpaste. Wait, why am I going so fast? Do you see this? You see that my hand is like, Flipped around weird. I do not think we were brushing our teeth this fast before with this toothbrush. Oh, <gasps> we can interact with the tissue paper. We we can hold the tissue. We can use the tissue. We can sneeze into the tissue. That's nasty. We're throwing that away. I'm gonna try it again just to test out the theory. Yup. Okay, so the face mask also disappears when you take a shower, and this animation also looks different it is different the animation is different we're washing our legs we're showering we're washing our hair look we're like washing our feet and our legs wow this is so good i am genuinely so impressed with this update so we also have the glasses we can't wear them but we can pick them all up i think yes we can what about the watch? Okay, the watch is just there for decoration. And the car keys, we can pick up the car keys, but I don't think they're gonna do anything for the car. Of course, we have the new perfumes too, so we're, we're spraying it, it's new, it's, it's realistic. We sprayed it on ourselves, and then we sprayed it on our wrist and rubbed our wrist together, and then smelled our, wow. This is crazy. We can use the nail polish too. I'm literally painting my stubs right now because I don't have fingernails. Oh my gosh, guys, this is insane. We could take the pick and we can use that. And like, imagine you had an Afro. For all my beautiful, melanated, curly head queens and kings out there, that is so good. This is so amazing. And then the wide tooth comb. The wide tooth comb is the same animation as like, the brush, I think. I could be wrong about that, but yeah. Um, I think we interacted with everything over there. So now we can, you know, pick up the magazines. We can see the back of the magazine and we can open it and we can read it and we are probably gonna flip through the pages. Yes, we're flipping through the pages. So that's really cool. And the newspaper, of course, and it, Oh my gosh, it like folds out so it's really big. Look. And of course you guys see like the coffee stain logo. Wow. This is so amazing. So this is like the fancy furniture set. Mostly fancy. Like the light up there, the light slash mirror up there is um is it's not part of like the fancy set. I just put it over here. So we have this, which we can sit on. There's these like privacy things. I don't know what they're called. And these are the canopies. So the canopies do not like come with the bed. You can put them on any bed that you want. But here's like that resting animation. Yeah, that's really cool. I like this fancy set a lot. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be using it in like my role playhouse because I think I've already like established the themes of everything. With that being said, it's still really cute. We have a bench, we have a nightstand, we have a desk. Here we have this adorable vanity set. So this is the thing I really am obsessed with. You can put your makeup right here and do your makeup. You have three mirrors, maybe four if you wanna add this one on there too. And then right here we have this dresser, which I think is super cute. I love tall dressers like this. We have this new fancy light and we have this dresser too. It's like a wardrobe sort of thing. We have this adorable little statue that I colored pink because it looks like a unicorn. We also have this chair that I've seen people build for like a good year now and now we actually have one. So yeah, it's it's cute. I thought it was gonna swing, but apparently not. So that's kind of it's kind of awkward, but it makes sense. It's still really cute. It's really like boho and I love it. So this is the industrial pipe set. I really did not know what to expect with this one, but I like it a lot. 
It's really cute. I like it more than I thought I would. I could actually see myself using this if I color it the right way. We have the industrial desk and chair and this like little lamp which is so cute there's also a bigger version of the lamp right over here here are the industrial beds but um again like these little comforters can fit on any bed i just put them on this one because it looked like it made the most sense there's some shelving up there that i can zoom in on there's empty versions and there's also like versions with those default books here are the industrial pipe mirrors. There's fairy lights now, and there's two versions. So there's versions with these pictures, and then there's another version without the pictures. You can turn them off. I think these are like pictures of the new dev team. And I'm pretty sure you can get a standalone Polaroid picture and customize it with any picture you want. So that's another really cool feature. Okay, everyone, well, that is going to be it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed watching and comment down below and rate this update out of five stars. I would definitely give it five stars. I think I'm mainly excited to have my animation pack back because again, that walk was ridiculous, but the new animations are so cool. I absolutely love this new development team. I cannot wait to see what the rest of 2023 has in store for us when it comes to Bloxburg. But if you enjoyed, do not forget to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Once you are subscribed, click the bell button so you get notified whenever I post a video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye! I won't make it easy for you now. up my time and i don't really break too easily but i'm worth it cause i'll slip into your dreams and